Hey there, my name's Chad, and this is a lesson from my Illustrator course. Check out the link in the description for more information. Thanks. In this lesson, you'll learn the type on a path tool. It's a pretty cool tool, whether you're wanting to create some kind of logo or even a title to an illustration or a feature story or even a poster. So go ahead and create a new file. And first, we need to create a path for the type to go on. So one simple example would be a circle. So click and hold onto the rectangle tool, go down to the ellipse tool, click and drag, hold shift for perfect circle. And so we have a basic circle here. And if you click and hold onto the type tool, go down to the type on a path tool and hover over the path here. And if you click, notice we don't have a fill or a stroke to this shape anymore once we click and we can type in our text This is some copy, and if you choose one of the selection tools up here, you can click this little thing right on the opposite side of the circle, uh, you'll notice right there, if you click that line there, you can actually move it around so it can be on the inside, like that, and it can be on the outside like we have it already, and you can move it around the edge if you want. So depending on where we want it to end up, uh, we can move it around. You can also, of course, double click and click and drag here. Just get the cursor in there, I mean, and change the font size and keep typing on there. Uh, but again, you just want to choose one of the arrows and then move it around and we can edit it. Or you can even put it on the outside. So it takes some getting used to to move it around, but basically you can move it all the way around this on the inside or the outside. And that's a circle example. But if you want to do something more customized, I mean, you could do even like a starburst. I mean, you can add a type and a path to, and it can just go around the edges. But pre-made shapes are fine, but you can also create an original shape. So a lot of times you'll use the pen tool and click, click and drag, click and drag. It doesn't matter that we have a fill or a stroke because um, it's going to erase it once we use the type on a path tool. Just make sure we're on this path here. And then all right, so we got some type. We can change the font up here just like normal, the size, and we can use the arrows here and move it around. We could put it on the bottom, put it on the top. What's pretty neat is we can still adjust the shape, this uh, the path. So if I click on the end here, I can still edit it after we've typed. And same thing over here. I can move the anchor points, the paths in between, and the handles to adjust that curve. So that's the type on a path tool. I will see you in the next lecture. Hey there, my name's Chad, and this is a lesson from my Illustrator course. Check out the link in the description for more information. Thanks.